His career is nothing short of spectacular. Tiger Woods is undoubtedly classed as a sporting phenomenon and is on his way to becoming the most successful golfer of all time. But the success isn't all personal. Tiger Woods has been credited with single-handedly boosting interest in the game of golf worldwide, increasing TV audiences, and bringing in huge wealth to the sport in terms of prize money and sponsorship. The fact that Tiger's father, Earl, put a golf club in his son's hand before he could even walk has been well documented. With constant training and coaching throughout his tender years, perhaps it should come as no surprise that Tiger was shaped into the champion he is today. Woods won his first major, the Masters, in 1997 at just 21, becoming the tournament's youngest ever winner. He has now been world number one since 2005, and through his endorsements and appearance fees, earns an estimated $100 million per annum. But even the world's most gifted golfer contemplates the future of his game. Um, I could not live with myself going out there and practicing and, and preparing as hard as I do now, and knowing that if I go out there and play my best, um, someone's just going to beat me. Um, but that happens. Your skills diminish, guys get better and more athletic. Um, you, you had your time in the sun. There's, there's no reason, there's no, there's nothing wrong with walking away from it. And um, you know, I've accomplished so much in the sport already, and hopefully I can continue to do that for as long as I possibly can. But once that, that time comes, every athlete knows when that, that happens. Um, some try and prolong it, that, that little, you know, that early exit. But one of the great things about our sport is you can, you can play as long as you want. Sure. Um, but do you want to play in, in mediocrity? Um, that's, the, that's the thing that I would have a hard time with. Um, I can't go out there and, and know that uh, if I play my best, I'm not going to win. More career major wins and career PGA Tour wins than any other active golfer. The youngest player to achieve the career Grand Slam and the youngest and fastest to win 50 tournaments on tour. Tiger Woods has broken almost every record in golf along the way. So, is retirement beckoning? Pete Sampras won his US, last US Open at, I think, 31. And at the time, people were saying, oh man, he's way over the hill. I'm, I'm 32, I feel like I'm just entering my prime. Since his father passed away in 2006, Woods has said that he misses his mentor and best friend enormously. He enjoyed watching me grind out major wins. It brought a smile to his face, he has said. The Tiger Woods Foundation, launched by Woods and his father in 1996, has raised millions of dollars to help underprivileged youth. Tiger continues to donate generously to his charities, including the Tiger Woods Learning Center in Anaheim, California. The center features extensive multimedia facilities and a golf teaching area, and it's his opportunity to spend time with young fans. By coming up here, we're hanging out with the kids. It's totally fun, I and mean, that's that's what it's all about. And hanging out with the kids, playing video games with them, and um, seeing some of the kids from the Learning Center here, it, um, that's what it's all about. The world has never before seen a sportsman the likes of Tiger Woods, a golfer whose amazing youth and amateur form have been followed by equally amazing professional victories. The golf star has obsessively shunned publicity for years, but following the rumors surrounding a car crash outside his home in 2009 and tabloid stories of affairs and relationships, Tiger has had to face some huge PR challenges. Whatever the future holds, Woods will always be credited with popularizing the sport of golf, not only among African-American people and other minorities, but among children of all backgrounds. But will Tiger Woods' exceptional playing abilities continue to match his passion for the sport? According to his late father, Tiger is pushed by history and by records and by his own goals. He doesn't need anybody pushing him.